Hello from Teen Jet Dragon's YouTube channel. This is Tsifu, and today we're gonna talk about two words in Chinese uh, that is most often used during the Chinese New Year period or some kind of celebration time. This is Gong and Ho. Okay, the word Gong is like oh Gong Hei Gong Hei. Okay. So when people say gong hei fa chao, you know, like that, what is the gong? Gong itself, okay, composed of two parts. The top is gong, which is like together, same frequency, okay, together. And uh, the bottom part is xiu, the swoop small, but with the right side, you have one more dot, okay? So what that means, basically, is like you and I, together the frequency will tune and align and adjust so now our heart is flowing to about the same frequency inside that matter that event okay we are going to start something and then i am going to gong you which means i'm going to put my heart energy into you and so you can keep it okay so it's like when you are uh, having a business opening, let's say grand opening, I go there and gong zhok you, which means I go and I put my heart energy by maybe uh, saying it, wishing you something, which, which you will feel that my heart is with you, okay? Now, when you feel that, because I wish you something, okay? Oh, I feel this guy really wish me. He is like in line with me, okay? He's like this ally, okay? Like that. Then what? Then your heart gets support. And because this heart energy, the D5 yellow energy, which we call, okay? The D5 energy. This energy, the heart energy, is uh, the type of energy that makes things happen. It's the energy of creation which helps when you are trying to do something, it helps you be able to do it for real and be able to start or be able to move on. And when things are outside, it's trying to come and influence or impact uh, or, or ruin your path, okay? This thing is what um, shield and support you from the uh, inside out to shield from all these attacks and let you keep going. So you can say, for someone having more of this D5 energy, this heart energy, it makes them stronger. It makes them uh, more uh, successful because they can move on and do their thing better. They feel more pumped inside, okay? So that's basically what Gong is about. You're giving them more heart, okay? And to do that, you'll be saying things, expressing yourself, by wishing them whatever, whatever, whatever. Now, the other word ho is very different. Usually, you listen to like ho lin, okay? You're going to hear to ho lin. Now, what is ho? Ho is the top word, is the ga, which is the power into a mouth, okay? And then the bottom part of that word is the bui, which means to receive the light and store it inside the ground okay what that means okay is basically like this if i am going to hold you okay what i'm doing is i'm putting my power into you and let you get that power now when you receive that power okay it will turn into light and it goes into you and you can store it up now what that means is it goes into you and stay inside you okay it can stay inside the ground so if I do this by using a solid object, like a gift, it must be something that um, can express my inner feelings to the outside. And I give it to you. You keep it and you can put it inside your house, inside your store, something like that, and you store it up. So later, you can take it out and be able to make use of it. Okay? That's how I can hold you. I give you something that you can make use of it later. We say the bottom part is to receive the light. Light right here is not like light, okay? Light is about something that is already done, something that is completed, which you can receive, okay? So it goes in as potentials. 
So you are storing in, let's say, okay, you are you are about to start your business about whatever, like you're making video. I give you a camera, new one, okay? This is completed. I give you a camera to haul you. So you keep this camera at home, put it aside, and it will be leading to your future, your potential. Because now you can take this thing out and make use of it and give birth to many, many new things. So that's the way I can haul you. Now, if you're not using a gift to haul someone, you can always use your body, which we call dou haul. Dou haul is like you go there and show yourself. Why do you want to show yourself? Because now the light is your body. Everything right here, you're the completed body, right? So you're showing your body to let the other side receive the light, which means they can look at you and all that visual go inside through your eyes and into their memory. This memory will be stored inside them and it will not be erased because they have seen something, it goes into the memory, it will never be erased. Now, later on, maybe after a while, they can always think back, oh, like, let's recall that day someone came and this guy came. Oh, yeah, okay. So they will remember who came, who supported them, and what. And it will lead to their potential, meaning that they know, oh, let's say, okay, let's say you are the president of the country. You visited this store while they're having like a grand opening, okay. Now, the guy look at you and, wow, president is here, okay? Absorb that light into them, store in. Uh, okay, after that day is gone, okay? Maybe like two months later. They encounter some kind of difficulty, okay? So they think back, oh, you know what? The president came before. He supported us. We should not fail and like not disappoint him. Now that becomes your inner support. The inner support will make you stand strong and keep going because it's like, oh, I remember this guy came before supporting us. We got to do better. We got to keep going, you see? Because of that memory, you will keep going. You will not want to fail because you know these people came and once supported you. So showing yourself to let's say, uh, uh, like New Year event, New Year event or something like that, it's a way to haul as well. But to talk, to say things, to wish them is to gong, which gives them energy. So when you gong, it gives them more energy. When you haul, it gives them more potential. So two things, okay, energy and potential. So basically, that's the, the difference between Kung and Ho, and they're very, very different. Okay, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!